Twitter permanently suspended Trump's account, causing many to worry about abuses of power by internet giants to suppress freedom of speech. There is a lot of opposition coming from France and Germany. However, I don't think that this is something that Twitter and a few American internet giants did out of their business interests. Those companies are actually the forefront of the U.S.'s current political struggles. They have all joined the anti-Trump camp. This is a joint action of the anti-Trump camp. As far as Twitter's interests are concerned, the existence of a Trump account and the controversy it serves are more conducive to the prosperity of the platform. Losing the drama of Trump's account will reduce Twitter's appeal as a social media. Twitter is actually making a sacrifice for the collective interests of the anti-Trump camp. Twitter's actions are a portrayal of the polarization of America's political struggles. Although the political elites of the Democratic and the Republican parties fought each other in the past, many of their values and interests were still intertwined. Now the tearing apart of American society is reshaping lines between friends and foes blocking Trump and his supporters on the internet is a furious political fight.